Well, it's really a unique idea, locking your credit or debit card when you're not using it. I'm not talking about locking it in a safe, but instead locking other people from being able to use it when you're not. It's a neat idea, and we explain it in tonight's Don't Waste Your Money report. When a flyer from his bank arrived in Scott Kilmer's mailbox advertising a new app that would lock his debit card with a quick tap and swipe, he signed up. I could say, it's time for me to turn this off and just know that I have the peace of mind that no one can get to this account but me. The app Scott has is one of several some banks are offering designed to let customers prevent unauthorized charges. Here's how it works. Open the app and toggle this button to activation and the debit card is on. Transactions are approved. But toggle that activation switch the other way and try to buy something, the card is declined. We're all familiar with the bank systems that identify suspicious activity, but this is one that actually stops the fraud before the transaction occurs. Rob Gaynor of Malaze Software, the maker of the app Scott uses, predicts this technology will be the next big thing in banking and says right now more than 80 smaller banks and credit unions are offering their app for debit cards and the functions of this technology go beyond turning a card on or off. You can also do things such as asking for ATM limit increases, point of sale increases, or letting the bank know if you're going to be outside of the country. Keep in mind, though, in order to change any card settings with an app, you've got to be digitally connected. If you lose your phone or the battery dies when your card is locked, you could be looking for plan B to get money or make a purchase. Mobile banking is secured in multiple layers, from things such as embedding certificates in the device and on the phone and verifying those certificates as a consumer logs in. Scott trusts the app he uses and hopes it will help keep crooks locked out of his account. I know exactly where my money is being spent and better where it's not being spent. Hmm. Kind of cool, huh? Whether or not more big banks will adopt this technology really depends on whether it grows in popularity at the banks that already use it, which are most of mostly smaller banks. Yeah. So we'll see. But it's a good concept. Cool. Yeah, I think so too. A lot of people need to do that. Yeah.